stuff. When we go to the show, we're going to bring it. Jimmy beats Tucky every single day. That's because she's a nicer dog. Yeah. Whew. Ooh, that wind's picking up. Mm. I'm get a little windbreaker. They're finally settled down. We had them out to the house. We left them out at the house while we wormed and took a few videos and pictures of the Brene litter and they've settled themselves down a little bit. Look at a powerful rear end she has. They both do. Mm -hmm. I like a nice square rear end on a dog. Then, they're supposed to be able to chase a poacher down and jump on him and knock him down. They should have a good rear end. A good rear assembly. They're both in heat. They're coming out of heat. They're coming out of heat. They're just a year in May, so it'll be next year this time before they even get close to being old enough to think about having a litter. What are they, eight months, nine months, four, yeah. Eight months old. We can walk down here and see Ace. My water bill was $112. So I thought when Tim quit watering the cattle on our side of the road, it would be, you know, $50 or $60. Nope. It hasn't went down a bit. And, you know, considering I do 10 loads of laundry a day, which I haven't in the last few days, I have not. But if you add my laundry to his laundry, I have, we have. Mm -hmm. I think I'm going to plant some of these. Although one's a pine and one's a cedar and one's a pine and one's a cedar. Uh oh, I got tangled up. I don't know if that's hot or not. Erin said when her little boy heard your voice yesterday, he perked up and was looking for you. I said, great. The puppies love Lily more than they love me. Great. Yeah, uh-huh. Sure. <laughs> Giving her a hard time. Oh, whoa, what is that? It's a horse. Oh, it's a horse. It's a horse. Now this is when Juby had a fit. Don't you remember that? She tried to attack this horse. Stop it. Layla, uh, Layla. She reminds me so much of her mother. We'll not let that horse get you. Oh, we'll get it. Oh, she's probably gonna go run and buck and <laughs> kicking. Do her thing. <laughs> Do her thing. <laughs> That was Juvie was the one that was so yeah. bad the last time we came down here. She's the one that had a, got all twisted about the horse. Of course, I think I spanked her. That old horse is 30 something years old. <laughs> Go ahead. I don't think she'll let you. She's pretty wild. <laughs> now, don't act scared or you'll really scare our dogs. I actually touched her that time. <laughs> she has filled out pretty nice. She, I don't know if they have her feet trimmed or if they just stay that short. They look like she just breaks them off. Well, I'm glad Juvie settled down. The last time she was the one that had the, I mean, had a fit. Now put your hand down low. There you go. Now move forward. I'm sure they give her treats. Well, I only got dog treats, not horse treats. Mm, she won't smell of you. We have no apples. Actually, I do have apples at the house. Don't you know she'd be a mess if she had a baby? It's okay, Juby. I'm really proud the way Juby's acting. Now, she is one. She's with the cog. Don't you remember that? Oh, yeah. She tried to attack her the last time we was down here, and that's just the 
socialization, socialization, socialization. Just. <laughs> I throw a rope on her. You want to touch her? We'll, we'll ride her. Yeah. Put her in a round pen. So just desensitizing them and helping them see that the horses are not a threat. Which not to say a horse can get you, but on the other side of the fence, the horses are not a threat and they don't need to be scared of them or feel like they need to defend themselves from them. So we go back by and maybe Tuffy will relax and I don't want her to be reactive that way to them. We need to come down here and get that uh, hay, that hay feeder thing. Mm -hmm.